Today we're gonna to talk about the most searched question. Seven hundred million results. I've been in this industry for thirteen years. Thirteen years. Number one question that I hear is, is what's my payment? Today I'm not only gonna show you what the payment is, I'm also gonna show you what the payment buys. So let's check out some cars that would be maybe in your budget. Some of them are in my budget, some of them aren't. But yeah, let's go check it out together. This video is for informational purposes only. $10,000, $10,000, $10,000 does not buy anything there or nothing there. $10,000 is generally slightly over higher mileage. If you're looking at an SUV, you're definitely gonna have higher mileage. To get your most bang for the buck at $10,000, we're gonna need to look at sedans. Let me show you one. All right, so I'm definitely not gonna say less desirable because that's not the case. We sell a lot of these kind of cars. 2014 Hyundai Accent, 2017 Kia Forte. These cars right here, they're at the $10,000 mark, which makes them a little bit more desirable because they're a little bit more affordable. So I call them grocery getters, right? Uh, the point A, point B, basic transportation. That's what those cars are. And that's that's what you're gonna find at ten thousand dollars. All right, I know that this is gonna be uh, said down in the comments, so I'm just gonna go ahead and address it. Our house average interest rate, right? So basically, we take all of our deals, we average them all out, and then we get an average interest rate. That number is 4.99. These payments do not factor in credit. They don't factor in term. All of these deals are based off of 72 months. Just to try to keep it easy. So if uh, less than seller credit, it goes up a little bit. Great credit, then they're gonna go down a little bit. We've reached 20,000. We're at the 20,000 mark. 20,000 bucks, 350 a month. All my disclaimers are there on the other end of that, like back there a little bit. Right now we're looking at Chevrolet Camaro. That would be in your $20,000 price range. Pre-owned V6, 2018, $20,000. Low mileage, nice car, right? Chevrolet Cruze, that would work. That's 20 grand. Honda CRV, that would also work. So you kind of see where I'm going here. You're gonna get a really nice car, but nothing way over the top, right? We're not looking at big bodies yet. I guess you could fit one in again year mileage those two determining factors if you pump the year down and you bump the mileage up then uh, maybe we could get into a little bit bigger car but again this is just for information really nice cars Thirty thousand dollars going to calculate out to a five twenty one a month car payment. Five twenty a month, right there. GMC Acadia, a little bit older, not brand new by any means, but that's a Denali package. We could go down in equipment to get a little bit newer body style if we wanted to. Chevrolet Traverse, that would definitely be in there. Honda Odyssey, we're looking at vans now and uh, also the Pacifica. We could start getting into new cars as well. Again, we sell Cadillac, Buick, and GMCs, so my new cars are up there a little bit higher, which you're gonna see in a second, but like your Chevrolets, your Fords, your Toyotas, your Hondas, I mean, 30,000 bucks can buy you a brand new car. It can buy you a brand new car here. There's just not too many options. I didn't even mention it, but it's getting ready to be winter time, right? Four wheel drive. All of these trucks uh, within reach that you can see right now, those would all fall in that $30,000 price tag. You got a 2014, a 2009, obviously that's a lot less. Uh, 2009 Silverado, I'm looking through the camera there. Yeah, all those are way under $30,000, so those would work. But again, we're sacrificing mileage and we're sacrificing years. So yeah, let's go up to the next one. Did you guys know that the average car purchased in the United States is $37,000? But I can't talk to you Canada, I can't talk to you Australia, I didn't look up that fact. 40,000 bucks, pre-owned Cadillac. $40,000 buys you a 2014 diesel truck. All of my Canyons would fall into this. We're kind of close, right? The GMC Canyon, smallest truck the GMC offers. And then, uh, just walking a little bit further, we're gonna just walk a little faster past the diesels because they definitely don't fall into that. But you could get $700 a month, $40,000. You could get a GMC Sierra truck, which is brand new. So brand new factory warranty, no mileage, all that good stuff. 40,000 bucks, $700 a month. All right, on this one, you're gonna have to ask your dealership friends for some help, but $50,000 with rebates and discounts, that would work for a GMC Yukon, new GMC Yukon. This example, you're also gonna need a little bit of help, but this is a 2019 Cadillac XTS. Biggest body sedan that Cadillac offers. I should say one of their biggest that Cadillac offers. 53 grand, 50,000 bucks would buy you brand new Cadillac. I'm trying to find something else that looks close to 50. I think, I, I didn't have to walk too far, but right here's one. 
So there's a Buick LaCrosse, the new Buick LaCrosse, that'd be right around your $50,000 mark. And again, uh, maybe it's not for you, but that's your eight sixty a month car payment. So we could get a truck, we could get a big SUV, we could get a big body sedan Cadillac. Pretty much options. You got a lot of options at 50,000. Did you notice how like I kind of walked like around in a big circle? Yeah, I don't know if you picked that up on camera or not, but I was trying to avoid this one. This is a hundred thousand dollar Escalade. Personally, it's more than my mortgage, but that's beside the point. Seventeen hundred nineteen dollars, hundred thousand dollars buys you a Cadillac Escalade. I said I was gonna stay away from car stuff and that I wasn't gonna do any more car stuff, but I'm literally asked this question every single day. And so I just kinda wanna address it a little bit. If you saw value in it, hit the thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. My name's Cody Reed. I do a new video every single day. Just like the question, I'm online every single day. Hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. I'll see you guys next time. Deuces.